All right, guys, it's uh, September 1st. I didn't get to hunt this morning, but uh, we're getting out this evening. And uh, we got a field hunt we're going on. Uh, last couple of days, they've been flying in in the morning and in the evening. And it's not a lot of birds, but uh, I think it's probably somewhere between 25 and 50. We can get three or four flocks to fly in. We ought to have a good shoot, so. All right. We'll see what happens. We'll catch you down there in the field. All right, we made it to the field, and we've got a bunch of turkeys out here. Look at them youngins. A couple of mamas and some youngins right there. That's sweet, man. Sweet. Look at them coming out still. A couple of mamas coming. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. See them turkeys? Right there, no, right there. Okay. Turkeys. See them all? Mm-hmm. Sweet. All right, take take two here. All right, uh, today's the 1st of September. Uh, we had a member of our church pass away, and we didn't get to hunt this morning. Uh, so we're making an evening hunt. We've watched this field now for a couple weeks. My boss all actually lives right here close and on this property. And he's kept me up to date on the birds coming in here. Uh, we got two different fields, one out front, one in the back. And they're landing in both of them. We're just choosing to hunt the one in the back because it's just a little safer, a little better. And uh, we got Roseman, Brandon with us today. Hunter's going to be down here in a little bit. And uh, we'll give it a shot and see what happens, man. All right, uh, we're here set up here in this field. Uh, we hunt this spot every year for the last uh, all five or six years, and it's always been productive. We're anticipating the geese coming off this pond that lays over the ridge here. It ain't but a quarter mile, half mile away. They should come out and circle the field and come in. We should have some good shooting. Uh, we've got a dog with us today, Jake. Come around here and show the dog to us, man. Remington. Remington. He's uh, how old is he, Brandon? Two. Two. Two years old. He's been off to some training school and uh, does pretty good. So we're excited to put him out here in the field and uh, see how he does that in the field. He listens very well. Oh, Remington's a good dog, man. So we'll see what happens here. And we also, uh, Brandon's got th this, uh, this, uh, his 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 group of guys that he hunts with, he likes calling them goose. Pine, what's it Pine called? Creek. Pine Creek. Pine Creek. Uh, 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 waterfowlers. Yeah. And uh, so Pine Creek and uh, Kidwell hunting is yoking up today. And we're gonna have a fun time, man. We're gonna make it happen. Okay. <laughs> More coming. I hear more out front. Ready? Yeah, I got one up there. Somebody got one. Come in here. There's, watch him. Yep. Uh, so the uh, evening of the first day has come to an end, and uh, we had birds come in. Uh, we just didn't shoot good today. Uh, we were hunters showed up just a little late, and we went to go get some more decoys out of his car, out of his truck, and we had six come in. And uh, Roseman and Jacob shot like six times and got one goose. Then uh, when they came off the pond laying over here, uh, the whole flock basically come off. And uh, we had like oh, somewhere between 40 and 50 birds come in. And when we made the call, they were just 20 yards in front of us. And uh, we just shot bad, man. Just shot bad. I was 
I'm disappointed, but I want to thank the Lord for a great day. And uh, he sent birds. We just didn't do our job. So tomorrow's another day.